We've just come back from a two week trip to Walt Disney World and we wanted to show you what we bought. Now before we begin today's video, I do have to mention just a little disclaimer. Back on my trip in March, I upgraded my 14 day UK Disney ticket to an annual pass. This gives you 20% off merchandise and 10% off food and drink throughout the Disney parks and Disney Springs. So we're starting today's video with ear headbands. These retail at $27.99 before your annual pass discount. So we have this new Americana pair. These Epcot inspired United Kingdom pair. The new Pride Rainbow Ears. The Magic Mirror Ears which were released while we were away. The 2019 Blue Navy Ears. We have the Tightrope Walker Ears. The new Imagination Pink set. These were also released while we were away. The new Briar Rose Gold. The giraffe print that I wore to Animal Kingdom. And finally, this pair from the outlets, these were So I also picked up four new mugs from the Starbucks Bean There series. These retail at $19.99 for annual pass discount. We've got the new Hollywood Studios mug. We've got the new Animal Kingdom mug. The new Epcot mug. And the new Magic Kingdom mug. And also we picked up this tumbler. This retails at $25.99. So this one isn't Starbucks, but this one is part of the new Pride collection. This is a rainbow tumbler. And this retails at $22.99 before AP discount. Another thing that you can purchase in the parks are these magic bands. These can be purchased and linked to your My Disney Experience account. You can link your Fastpass selections and any photos taken throughout the parks. And if you're staying on site as a resort guest, you can also link these to your account with a credit card so that you can make purchases throughout. Now, as part of being an annual pass holder, you do get a free magic band. So I chose this orange one. And I also picked up this slider that goes on it that also says pass holder. These can be picked up from any guest relations throughout the parks and Disney Springs. Um, during the stay in June, there was also a new release of the Imagination Pink Ears. And this is the band that matches this. This was $14.99. I also picked up this light purple one. This was also $14.99. I got the new Pride Magic Band, this one was $24.99 and a little bit more expensive was this Americana one which was $29.99. 
As part of being a UK guest that purchased tickets through the Disney account, we received some free Toy Story Magic Bands that are exclusive to the UK. So, on to clothing. I bought a couple of jumpers, what we call them jumpers in the UK. These are called spirit jerseys. I got this new Americana one. This retails at $64.99. We will show close-ups as part of the video as well. I got this Briar Rose Gold Spirit Jersey and this one retails for $69.99. I also picked up this Mickey Mouse jumper which I wore home on the plane so it's a little bit dirty now and needs a wash but this one was $54.99 and it has Walt Disney World down the sleeve. Um, one of the tips we would recommend to people is to buy a cool in town. Now these are um, cheap, there are cheaper options that you can buy from Amazon. Mine was however $16.90 and this was from the parks itself. It has Mickey Mouse heads all over it. And also it did rain a little bit while we were there, but it wasn't necessary to wear this. However, I did quite like it. It is the Sweet Treat Rain Jacket, and this one retails for $49.99. And one of the things that Disney have started selling recently are these patches that you can use to customise your clothing with. This is the rainbow patch and this one retails for $9.99. So one of the other items I like to pick up during a trip to Disney are these postcards. These retail for $4.99 each. You can buy these from the art shops located throughout Disney parks or from the Marketplace Co-op at Disney Springs. We'll also show you close-ups of these. So this was a lucky find in the uh, Disney outlet at the premium outlets on Vineland. And this retails for $5. This was the last one in the shop. We also picked up this photo frame. This one was $29.99. And finally, Disney have introduced something new this summer. It's to do with the paving that used to be outside the front of the Magic Kingdom Transportation and Ticket Center. So the pavers are being removed, but you can buy replica pavers. This is the six inch size. There's also an eight inch size and a ornament size. Now this retails for $29.99. The eight inch retails for $49.99 and the ornament retails for $24.99. Another photo frame we picked up was this new photo frame. This is in the shape of Minnie Mouse's head with her bow. This is from the new Americana range and this one retails for $24.99.
So I've also started collecting some kitchen items. This serving set retails for $40. I also picked up these salt and pepper mills and these ones retail for $19.95 each. I also picked up this bottle opener. This one was $14.99. This one comes as part of a box set but I've already taken them out of the box. This is a wine gifting set and this retails for $22.99. It's got a corkscrew and a bottle stop. And I also picked up these kitchen tongs which have the Mickey hands as the shape of the glove and these were uh, $14.99. And other people got some other items for the kitchen. We got this new cereal bowl. It's got USA in the middle and then a uh, print around the side. There's this new tea bag holder. This one was $14.99. And this new Tigger mug, because my dad collects Tigger mugs. This one was $14.99. And we also picked this up from the Marketplace Co-op in Disney Springs. This is the green clover aloe and it smells just like soaring. So I picked up a couple of jewellery items. First up is this Orange Bird Alex and Annie bracelet. This retailed for $49.95. And as part of the new Pride collection, there was this Rainbow Love bracelet. This one was $44.95. I also got some new Pandora charms. Again, we will show you close-ups of these, but I first of all got the 2019 charm, the Epcot monorail charm, the new Hollywood Studios 30th anniversary charm, the Rainbow Love Charm and the Pass Holder Charm. The Pass Holder Charm is exclusive to annual pass holders. I also picked up some new earrings and these are rose gold with little Mickey heads at the bottom of them. And those rose gold earrings were $19.99. I got a couple of rings as well. Um, first up is this duo ring. It's the two Mickey heads crossing in the middle and this was $39.99. I also got this Mickey head curl ring and this one was $19.99 and Megan picked up this Arebus Brothers ring. Again, it's the two Mickey heads meeting in the middle and this one retailed for $90. I also collect a couple of pins when I go on my trips and so this time there wasn't a pin available in March for Coronado Springs which is where we stayed but then I spotted this one at the pin shop in Disney Springs for Coronado. I also saw this new rainbow jeweled one as part of the rainbow pride collection and this Disneyland sign it's the D for the Disneyland sign not for the Walt Disney World and I do like to collect a couple of ride pins, so rather than picking up three individual pins, I just picked up this Toy Story Land pin. I also picked up this Twilight Tower of Terror, and this one spins around at the back. And then I spotted these as well. These are part of the Disney Cruise Line. So there's the Dream, there is the Fantasy, there's the Magic, and the Wonder. And each of the pins on the back of them have a colour to tell you what the price of them is. So we'll insert a picture of that so you know what the prices are for them.
We also like to collect Christmas ornaments when we visit Walt Disney World. These are ones that are sort of exclusive to the parks that you can't get here in the UK. So I picked up this Fab Four set. These retail for £34.99. But my mum also picked up the personalised version, which have 2019 on all of them. But these are an additional $12, and that's $3 per word per bauble, so $12 to be able to get these. So we also picked up this Epcot ornament for the World Showcase. This represents the United Kingdom and this was $19.99. We always like to get a bauble for our tree that's personalised for our family. So this one says the Wallys 2019 to commemorate our trip. And this one we picked up from the premium outlets. This one was $4.99. We also picked up these princess ornaments. Now these represent six of the princesses and these retail for $26.99. We also get some random ornaments and this one is the Walt Disney World ornament and this one retails for $19.99. This one is part of the new Americana range. So it's got the flag on the front and then the Walt Disney World castle on the back. And this one is $16.99. And we also picked up this Tinkerbell ornament. This one has a bell in the bottom of it. And this one was So I also picked up these fluffy ornaments. These are $16.99 each. There's a Minnie Mouse, a Mickey Mouse and a Pluto. I also collect these ear hat ornaments and these retail for $24.99 but I do know that in the Christmas shops if you buy three they then become $20 each. Uh, this one actually lights up. I believe the fireworks light up when you turn it off. I picked up a couple of ornaments that were also in the outlets. This um, Nightmare Before Christmas ear hat ornament was $5.99 and this Pirates of the Caribbean one was also $5.99. Now Disney also do a deal on some other select ornaments that retail for $24.99 originally and again when you buy three you get them for $20 each and then you can get your annual pass holder discount on top of that. So I picked up this Aristocats ornament and this Lady in the Tramp ornament. Um, I've also got another Lady in the Tramp ornament to go with that deal. And as part of the new food and sweet treat collection, there are some new food style ornaments. These retail for $16.99. So I've picked up the Mickey Waffle, the Pink Macaroon, the Rice Krispie Treat, the Mickey ice cream bar, which I think is my favourite. The Mickey Mouse cupcake. And the Aloha pineapple cup. So I also picked up a couple of pens. Disney sell these ink pen style pens in the shape of Mickey Mouse's head or sometimes you get them in the shape of the characters. This one was released during the new Pride collection and this one is $7.99. And I picked up two pen sets as well. This one is a park pen set. Um, it's got things such as Madame Leota, um, River Expedition, Tiki Tiki Room. These are $16.99. And also this one is also $16.99.
And finally onto the three things. Every time I visit the Walt Disney World parks, I like to pick up a park map as a little memento. So these are for each of the four parks. And Disney have also started doing these pin badges that people can get to also celebrate special events. So this one is for first visits. This one is for happy birthday and they can write your name on these as well. There is this one for happily ever after, so people who are celebrating engagements or wedding anniversaries. And this one that just says, I am celebrating for generic events. These are free to pick up if you just ask the cast members in the parks or if you go to the guest relations. And finally, if as part of Mickey's 90th birthday celebrations you go and sign his guest book in the Town Hall at Magic Kingdom, they give you this free card that shows you how you can celebrate his birthday with 10 simple steps. And as part of that you also get some free stickers. So if anyone has any comments about any of the things we've purchased, if you'd like to know where they were from or any prices, just leave a comment down below. If anyone's got any questions about upgrading to annual passes, again leave those down below and we will answer those for you. Finally, one of the things that we recommend as part of the parks is when you get fed up with carrying your ears, especially during the rain, you take them off, you hang them on these lanyards and then we hang them on our bags as so. Uh, these are from a little shop on Etsy called Imagineers UK. We will leave the link to their shop down below. Thanks for watching.